Ooh, did he? <laughs> Hello friends, today we're going to be talking about economic collapse shakes. This is John Adams here with Death of GMO and Trillion Dollar Media. Here you can see we've just harvested some green tomatoes. So you can definitely harvest stuff like this. We've also got some tomato leaves. Now that we're starting to get into frost season, you know, you can harvest some of this stuff up. This is like extra type of food. Um, you know, since we're in the economic collapse, uh, the entire country is being destroyed and stuff, you're going to have to start eating every, anything and everything that you can. Here, this is a littler one. And we've also got some pepper leaves here. So you can actually eat pepper leaves. They're pretty strong, so you're not going to want to eat that many. So you could just throw like three of them into a shake. Here we're finishing off some of this um, sage. And we got different spices. And um, like the stems and everything. We're throwing that into this shake. Because, uh, you know, we got to add as much as we can. Plus this is actually probably severely healthy. We got greens in there already. And then we have cranberries. We got blueberries, strawberries, bananas, apples. All types of stuff. I like to throw some oil in there. We're going to throw a lot of different juices and stuff. We do have carrots in there as well. So, if you put this in there, so that kind of tops it off. You're going to want to have root vegetables and then like uh, above ground vegetables. Also fruit and greens. So it's the different types of stuff you're going to want into your shake. We're going to have to wash uh, lots of these leaves off here. So we're going to do that all. Be right back. Here we're adding some milk. That makes your shakes come out much better texture for the most part, depending on what you're making. But yeah, I definitely like to put milk in most of my shakes. We've also got some juice here, which is definitely good to get some, like just standard juice into your shakes. And we've also got some coconut milk. I like to have a lot of different variety and some oil even as well. So yeah, I like to just put a little teeny splash of oil into my shakes. It helps balance the texture and also the nutrients as well. That's all you need. All right, here we got all these greens, different tomato, basil leaves, pepper leaves and stuff. This can definitely, you know, add a significant volume to your shakes if you're struggling to fill your shakes up sometimes. Today, luckily, it looks like we were able to pretty well, but yeah, this can help contribute. You do this all year long or at least sometimes. You know, it's going to make a difference, and you got to have as many different plants as you can, really. So that's what, uh, what you can do in economic collapse time. Alright, here we are. we got a nice green one. Pretty thick, just about right. It's going to be delicious. So yeah, it's really nice to do this during the economic collapse times, being as um, Obama destroyed the economy and stuff. So if you're really struggling to afford your food, it can definitely be good to eat pepper leaves, tomato leaves. You can eat carrot leaves, beet leaves. You can actually eat daisy plants. You can eat all different types of stuff. And by incorporating it into your shakes here, you can actually utilize stuff that you wouldn't have been able to utilize otherwise. Play basketball. 